Welcome to our video walking you through the Performance Reports tab. This tab can provide more insight into how much you're earning and what affects those earnings. In this video, we'll run a sample report to view page CTR and CPC over the last 30 days. The first step is to adjust the date range so that we're looking at the last 30 days. Next, we'll select our data. To the right of the graph, there are a handful of checkboxes. Checking these boxes will allow you to select the data you'd like the graph to display. To see page CTR and CPC, select the appropriate checkboxes. We now have two lines, a yellow line for page CTR and a purple line for CPC. The axis for page CTR, the yellow line, is on the left-hand side of the graph, and the axis for CPC, the purple line, is on the right. If you hover your mouse over the graph, you can see the specific values for page CTR and CPC by day. If you look at the upper right-hand corner of the graph, you can see the date and corresponding CPC and page CTR for that date. For more detail on what any of the checkbox metrics mean, hover your mouse over the question mark bubble and read the popover description. Play around with different combinations of data points and time periods to see if you find any interesting trends, like if your earnings follow a similar pattern to your page views. Sometimes it's helpful to compare how your ads performed over two time periods. To do this, first click on the date range dropdown. Check the box next to Compare to other dates. Enter the start date of the time period you'd like to compare. The end date will be filled in automatically, so both ranges you're comparing span a similar amount of time. Click the Apply button, and your data will be displayed on the graph. We hope this video helped you get used to navigating around the Performance Reports tab. Check back in on our YouTube channel to learn how to run more advanced reports in order to gain even more insight into your account's performance.